Woo! Okay. <clears throat> so, we are here. At uh, Azura's uh, thing. And, uh, yeah, that's what we're we doing. So, just to start off, let's just test some stuff. There's a sword in your hand, bitch. It's so nice to just talk a little, you and I. I was just thinking, would you be interested if I told you a little about myself? Please, go ahead. As my presence didn't seem to be very appreciated by the Dawnstar Innkeeper, I left pretty soon. I didn't have a clue about where to look for the Elder Gleam Sanctuary, so instead I headed for Solitude, thinking that the Kajit Bard might be there. Solitude is quite amazing, Hello, isn't Ramos it? Fanboy. And the Bard's College. Appreciate oh, it. Oh, I would love to spend some more time there. I'm a, I'm a number one fanboy. Unfortunately, really? the Kajit Bard with my flute hadn't been seen there. Hmm, I wonder if he is a real Bard at all. I couldn't find anyone who knew about Elgrim's sanctuary either, and I was pretty broke. So I started to ask around for work. First I went to the Radiant Raymond, but the elf ladies there didn't seem to like the way I look. They said that I had no use for a countryside girl like me. Bah! Snobbish Altmus, as if their dresses were that pretty. Then I went to the Fletcher. Did I ever tell you that I'm quite good at fletching? I can make arrows for you if you wish. I only need some firewood and ingot. And a workbank, of course. Unfortunately, I didn't have any luck at the Fletchers. They had just hired a new guy, you see, so they hadn't got any use for me. So, instead I got work as a barmaid at the Winking Skiver. I quite liked it there. Minette, the daughter, is such a fun girl. She reminds me of my younger sister back home. Look, I do enjoy talking, but maybe we should take a break now. I guess we have other things to do as well. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> talk later. Sorry, I was just thinking about spiders. They are so satisfying to squash. Oh, I hate spider capes. The webs get in my hair. It is a small price to pay. There is very little more enjoyable than a bit of spider slaying. Ugh, that's disgusting. Vilia, come on. Do you not enjoy the noises they make when you hit them? Oh, God. Me? Definitely not. Okay, do not worry. I will happily take care of any spiders we meet. It is a hobby of mine. You're really strange. Do you know yeah. that? Yeah. So Vilja um, is kind of an older mod that got ported to special edition. Do you know edition. what I would fancy right now? A sweet roll. Um, and she... Like, yeah, unfortunately when her voice was uh, done, it wasn't so good. But uh, it's a very high quality mod and I really like playing with it. So it's just kind of something that I have to like, just kind of like got to sacrifice a bit. Vilja, tell me your thoughts. Does that work? Yeah. All right, I'm going, oh. Cree! Adjustment. Oh, that's not bad. Okay. So I just actually set up, give me a second here, a like a, a 
headset, what do you call it, uh, pulley system in my house. So, it's, it shouldn't pull on, or, so I don't trip on cords. Azura, goddess of twilight. Oh, that's me. Hello. You can see me. I can dance and shit. Forgot that's a thing. My queen. I came here to worship this hell. Azura's the Daedric Prince of uh, Twilight, the Moon and Star. She has a significant role in the I game world. The statue of Azura oh, is beautiful, but she should be warm and dressed in this frozen environment. Azura has seen your coming, Traveler. It was not curiosity, but fate that has led you here. Seen my coming? What do you mean? Azura has given me the gift of foresight. I had a vision of you walking up the steps to this altar long before you were born. You have been chosen to be her champion. I know it is unexpected, but do not worry. It will all unfold as she has predicted. I forgot about this guy. There is no one else. Oh. But very well. I cannot force you. That's to not what I meant to do. Fuck. Destiny. Azura has given you have been chosen to be her Very champion. Well. What does Azura need? I know it is on you must go to a fortress endangered by water yet untouched by it Inside you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night It is cryptic I know but Azura's signs are never wrong I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold Ask if they know this elven enchanter. Where did this shrine come from? My people, the Dunmer, built it. We fled from Morrowind after Vardenfell erupted almost 200 years ago. Those of us who were faithful to Azura were given a vision that led us away from the island before the worst came. This shrine is our thanks to her that none will forget that she watches over us all. Are you here all alone? Yes, there were others at first, but Azura's visions tested everyone's faith. One by one, they left, afraid to know their own future. But I refuse to abandon the shrine. The visions are a gift. Azura warns me of tragedy, war, death, before it happens, I won't leave her guidance. I'd like to know more about Azura. She is the goddess of dawn and dusk. Azura sees into the twilight of the future and guides her followers through it. May Azura's magic protect you. Sun, and it basically allows you to have different religions, which gives you different buffs and stuff. Now that we are here in Winterhold, maybe we should look around for that elf who can turn the brightest star as black as night. We could go to Winterhold. Hmm. So how long do I sit here? Uh, 
this go? Maybe I can walk to Winterhold? That'd be cool. Never been there before. Maybe we should head for Winter. Yes, bitch. I mean, we're gonna go. not sure what to say about Alania and her visions. When I have visions, it's mostly about herring meatballs or strawberries. What do you mean I just leave? Um, I, like, oh, the shrine? Well, I have to go, uh, uh, to the place now. Winterhold. Now, I wasn't planning on doing this quest. Oh, shit. Anything. Equipped healing right. Or summon healing right. Does that work? Let's see. Uh, yeah. Summon healing left. Oh, okay. So you just have to equip it. What's going on here? Oh, well, that's not what I wanted to do. How are you doing? You don't look well at all. Those bits of dead insect you are carrying are making Mr. Dragonfly nervous. Summon healing left. <laughs> Not sure why that's happening. So pale. Are you ill? Fancy your taste my sword forever. Strange. Wait, am I just going back the way I came? Oh, I love the Azura quest, but I'm also like a slut for Azura, so yeah. I guess that anyone who works I at forgot, the Brandy uh, farm would deserve a mug of brandy. I forgot that you can start the quest at her shrine, which makes sense. I thought you just had to find him in the bar, but what I really want to do is go to. Um, 
uh, do the moon and star quest. That's a mod, and it's one of my favorites. I think I need more sleep. Oh, yeah. All right. I'm just trying to remember my controls. What kind of sucks, too, is depending on where you move your hand will determine, like, how your uh, sleep... Oh, see? That's... That's voice recognition stuff, so I need to probably set that up better. Oh, I'm gonna die if I do that. Oh, shit. Before I enter any city, I should. Greetings, brother. You look weary. I have something to help you relax, if you're interested. What are you talking about? The finest skooma. The sweetest moon sugar. At a fair price, of course. This doesn't really seem legal. Ah, a snitch, eh? Can't have you running to any guards now, can I? I'm gonna you can't your get up! I told you to go! What a clean with a sword. Whoops. Oh, hey. N narc. <laughs> I'm not a narc. I've tried so hard I just wanted to ask him a fucking answer. question. I and then he was just like, yo, what's up? I have a similar problem. My eyes and ears are still covering him. from Next time, I'll teabag the next guy. Cast oh, FA. I've never been here before. I've got a clean oh shit. Whoa. <laughs> oh shit. Why don't you make yourself disappear? Ha ha! Ah! If that was your best, All right. you are a big trouble. Summon Ice Spike left. You'll make a <laughs> I think my spike skills have improved since I met you. Don't you think so too? Okay. I'm not a noble per se. But, uh, you're not looking so good, buddy. Knock, knock. I guess I can't get in. Fucking place. Did you oh yeah, it's just a tea bag. Yes. Okay, sorry, I don't know sorry. what it was. Okay, hold on. You just for you. You are as good as All dead. Right. Shame you will not learn from this. Uh, oh, hold on. Uh, uh, <gasps> okay. I'm gonna do this again. There, so you can see me. Today will be a good day. I can feel it in my fur. Ooh, fucking woo. Okay. Alright, let's uh, do a dungeon. Oh. It's because I'm stupid and fucking half. I can't do it with my left hand. Do I have the regular crouch going? No, I don't. I think I have to. Okay, cool. in here. Uh, summon left hand torch? That's not exactly right. Summon... Okay. I think I need to fix my voice recognition stuff. Woo woo. The lazy Shinigami. Oh, hey! Some 
man's just chilling. It's not what I wanted to do. Like that though. I wish you could sit down somewhere. You that tired? Come on, man. So far, today smells lovely. I hope it does not rot as the hours pass. Thanks for joining the stream, stream guys. I kind of wish I could hear a noise every time you guys chat so I could check it, you know? Nuzzles bulge beneath saber tooth pelt. So <laughs> ooh, ooh. Surprise, surprise, I'm not a furry. Oh. Who are these guys? Thanks for your song, bitch. Ugh. Probably going the wrong way, but uh, fuck it. Oh, this is. Guess what? I found one of those ingredients I was looking for. Isn't that great? Fantastic. Wonderful. <laughs> I probably have to search for your ingredients too, but today's about Morrowind. Sorry, Vilja. Come along, no more stops. We need to find our way to Solitude. Why are we even going to a wedding at this far-flung end of the Empire, anyway? I told you, it's the wedding of Vittoria Vici, an extremely well-connected merchant with the East... Where did I fucking... Where am I going? Dude, isn't Winterhold, like, there? Jesus fucking Christ. Need something? Hopefully these gifts will put us yeah, in fuck good it. graces. Yeah, fuck it. Secure that import deal. We're gonna go to the Moon Star. The to an audience with the Emperor. Where's Winhelm? This way. <laughs> I don't even know anymore. Okay, so if we take a left, we'll get the wind helm. Okay. Hey man, I don't know if they get robbed. Meta shit. I heard that the maid she'd winterhold turned a young girl into a frog when he tried to remove her friend's wooden shard. Scary, isn't it? Magic is scary. It's just how she be. It's just how she be. It's running really well. 120 frames. No reprojection. Skyrim may be cold, but it is surely very beautiful. Wool. You know, Skyrim's a completely different looking game when you're kind of in it. It's kind of a weird sensation. Do Twitch chat in your pocket, probably. In no front way. of you. <laughs> Yeah, she does talk a little bit. I could probably set her to talk a little bit less. But uh, you know what? Just out of curiosity, let's let's do that. I don't I just don't want her to stop completely. Hmm. Okay, hold on. I swear that Dura, wouldn't it be nice to just talk a little, you and I Sorry, we'll talk in a bit. What do you need? Is something wrong? I thought you wanted me to do something for you. You look so pale. Are you ill? Yes. Tell me, which topic should we discuss when you call for me? So, is there anything you'd like me to do? How are you doing? 
You don't look well at all. What's in your mind, friend? Yes? Oh, I'm sorry. You want me to keep quiet then? I see. Well, I can understand that you need some time for your own thoughts instead of listening to me all the time. I'm on a pilgrimage to the Shrine of Azura, the goddess of twilight. Does she have a rendered butthole? I don't think she does. Actually, you know what? She might. She might. I do have a uh, titty mod on here. But, uh, <laughs> she might. <laughs> I haven't looked at their buttholes yet. The vaginas are on Guess there. I'm just being silly. I'm trying not to fast travel. That's kind of why uh, I'm walking. I only f generally fast travel unless I really have to. Or, um... How are you doing? You don't look well at all. <sighs> okay, so apparently I have a disease. Fuck. Okay, I might have to go to the potion store. Ah. <sighs> It's like a painting. One female adventure Twitch at. I'm just like, man, Vilch is sweet. She's really cool. Her quest line's cool. She's very interactable. And she interacts with Inigo, and Inigo's kind of like fucking amazing. Speak to me. Any thoughts? I'm thinking you look ill. If you need anything else, Jesus. just ask. Everyone thinks I'm sick. <laughs> Hooey. Uh, okay. Inigo does not like this place. Wolt! Just had some gestures, that'd be fun. You could just be like, fuck you. I'm just Canadian. I'm just Canadian. Look <laughs> Oh no. Okay. I think it auto saves, so if I shout at someone. Why oh. do so many people live here, I wonder? Do they enjoy misery and aggressive architecture? What really puzzles me is that Agonians, Kayits, and Elves don't leave the place. Considering how they are treated. Right. Everyone says Yorland Greymane is the best Fuck in Skyrim. Got something for just about everybody in here. No offense. Take a look. I take it. Wait. Better. He's probably gonna say I look like shit. Well, doesn't matter now. Now we're gonna do some exciting stuff. Moon and Star, fantastic fucking mod. It's uh, very Morrowind themed, and that's a new village. There's some compatibility issues uh, depending on what you're using. Nothing major though. 
and uh, yeah, it's just it's just really it's not too too long. Just it's nice. It tickles my marrow and prostate. Were you an adventurer, huh? Yeah, that's a thought. Snow is a lovely. But when it is heavy, it sometimes builds up inside my ears. Uh, my ears do the not VR is good. The there as isn't much as that I much do. games that are really Compared that good. But Skyrim VR small. is pretty, pretty awesome when it's modded. Falkreath, and then go that way. Need a ride? I'd like to ride your carriage. Where do you want to go? Falkreath. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Oh, steady. <clears throat> Did you see a dog out there? What sort of dog? I don't know really. The blacksmith is offering a reward for a dog he saw on the road. I was hoping you'd seen it. I guess I'll stay on the lookout. Keep your nose clean while you're here, outsider. Jesus fucking Christ. Why is everyone so hostile? They're not my slaves, they're my friends. Right? We're friends. Something on your mind? Any thoughts? No. My mind is as blank as your expression right now. Uh, no offense. I was... talking high of you. Find the lost dog. It's supposed to be Morrowind themed. I gotta stay on track. Hopefully, this will lead me to the lake. And hopefully, the mod isn't fucking broken. You. Summon uh -oh. Ice Bike left. Let's go over there. That's a bandit. Ha ha! Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. You just like one hit them? Bush too. They're like, oh, we're gonna get you. And she's just like, yeet. Inigo comes with an ebony um, bow, but I you removed that to find you. You're my sword. fucking huge. I 
Peta. What's a milk drinker like you doing out here? Go home to your mother. God, people talk sh mad shit here. Just to be safe, real quick save. Since I haven't played Skyrim in a while and it's modded, and I have overclock. With my old settings, I used to like cause my computer just to shut off. It would just be like, eat, bye. But no, it's running really well. I have a good uh, super sampling rate too, and it's giving me mostly 100 plus frames. That's pretty. Okay. What is this? Fine, Amazon. Interesting. Disease again. Get fucked. The Fight Club dwellers be like, What's a milk drinker doing here? Wold. Oh, it's not working. Wold. It's not working? I love archery. I oh. once shot a flea off a troll's body. This is why we. Pieces. If he hadn't slipped, I would have got his head. Oh no. Well, it not hard crashing to... This is good. Jesus. No, man. She is wicked. She stays for now. But I broke the game. God damn it. God damn it. <laughs> you kidding? I didn't get disease from her, man. I stepped on a fucking trap. Ugh. See, and I just saved you. Uh... So she has a dick. Oh my god. <laughs> Leave Vilja alone. Yeah, not having the step on the cord is pretty cool. And just so you know, I'm in my boxers. I'm naked. I'm la naked. Now, if it causes a crash again, then I know there's something fucked up in the area and we're gonna have to yeet myself out of here, which is kind of annoying, but. Yeah, it was just right here, too. No GPU. I was looking for oh. isn't that great yes it's fantastic thank you good to know I have to find you the ingredients as well all right let's uh, let's do a hard save here and then hopefully shit doesn't go boom. world 
are just some scripts. Ooh, I should do the Bruma mod later. That'd be cool. I heard that a mage in Winterhold turned a young girl into a frog when he tried to remove a freckle. Did we not just talk about this? Alright. No. Oh, oh God. shit. I've got a clean oh. door, that's all. Oh. What the fuck is this? Wait, is this? Oh, this is, uh, Helgen. How did I end up here? Not good. I wish I could use a sword that well. the wrong way. No, maybe not. I, I know where I can go, so we'll do the what the quest. recognition thing have it a little bit more recognize my voice a bit you, you can train your voice to essentially your system kind of knows you better all right so snow I... is a lovely but when it is heavy it sometimes builds up inside my ears my ears do not enjoy the snow as much as I do Oh, I don't know. It's just another foggy day. Nothing special, really. Okay, I think this is the way I want to go. Okay, so I just like went in a circle because of fucking mountains. Actually, I'm not butt naked, but I could be. Wearing boxers. But thank you for the company. It's always fun to have someone to directly talk to. Okay, I don't know if I want to go directly to Falkreath. I kind of want to hit the lake. Cree! I don't know how that was Cree, but all right. See, that's where I want to go. That's not in the main game. So. Let's continue. Let us continue on this quest. Okay. 
thought they were gonna talk some shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> no sign of them. Huh. Hello there, fellow traveler. What? Hello there, friend. How lucky for you to chance upon a bard on the road. Can you teach me a bit about speechcraft? Ah, well, after a little incident with a roguish lad and uh, the daughter of a prominent thane, well, let's just say, best not. Afraid not. But if you're serious about sharpening that tongue, you might try the Bard's College in solitude. Until next time. Thanks for nothing. So, for those who've never played Skyrim in VR, um, some of the mods they have, it's called Varric Body, so I can see my body except my hands, and it allows me to equip weapons and stuff in different slots. Um, ooh, you know what? I should see if this works. No. 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 Okay, so... How does this one work again? Let's... I should be able to throw weapons, which is pretty cool. Mod configuration. Weapon throw. How do I have it set? Uh, general. Trigger. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> yeah! No one took my sweet roll. God. We must go there. Huh. Herp a derp. Okay. This is a good spot to make a hard save. Can I help you? What can you tell me about the village? Sorry, no time for tours right now. I've got a full docket of nothing ahead of me for the day. If you want to talk to someone, go find Celise. If you want to be talked at, go find Belvedere. Who are you? So long. Okay. That was rude. Something you need, traveler? Who are you? I am called Balran. I hunt and fish for the village. Um, can you tell me about the village? I can. 
Why is this place called Little Vivek? Because we are a village of Dunmer on the water, and some found it clever to name it after another village of Dunmer on the water. Do you find it clever? I do not. So this is a Dunmer village? Lady Celise can offer you trade for any good you can think of, and I can teach you the way of the bow. That is all I'm afraid. Is this a Dunmer village? It is a village founded by Dunmer refugees, yes. We tired of our treatment in Windhelm and moved south. Who else lives here? Lady Celise Andrethil and Albert live in Celise Trade House. The twins share a home, and Lady Valina Rathvasi lives across from the twins. Belvedere is also there, I suppose. I'll talk to you later. I'd like to know more about this village. Looking for gossip, huh? All right. What would you like to know? Why is this village called Little Vivek? Ugh, by Azura. You had to ask, didn't you? Just hearing the words gives me a headache. You can thank Belvedere for that one. He just thought it was so clever. Everyone else hated it, but he pitched such a fit about it. You don't get along with Belvedere, I take it? No one gets along with Belvedere. We take him about as seriously as a mud crab. Well, not quite. At least mud crabs have claws. Even his wife thinks he's a buffoon. I guess she doesn't mind, and neither do the twins. Yes, both of them. Is this a Dunmer village? Well, that's why it was founded. We were sick of Ulfric Stormcloak's racist bullying. So we left Windhelm, and got as far south as we could to start a new life for ourselves. We're not all Dunmer, though. Albert is Norn, but he's still my family. And anyone who says he doesn't belong here will answer to me. What services does the village provide? You're looking at him. I'm the town merchant, crafter, alchemist, and healer. Balrun can give you some tips on using a bow, but otherwise I'm your one-stop shop. So be nice. Who else lives here? No, oh, why not? Do you need help with anything? As a matter of fact, I could actually use some help restocking some supplies. What do you say? Want to make some quick gold? Sure. Great. Here's a list of what I need. Bring me that and you're 300 septums richer. Plus a bonus for quality. And don't even think about haggling. I'm overpaying as it is. Somewhere I could sleep. I think my fight is. My future is brighter than whoa, yours. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna start that over because apparently I killed someone. Looking for gossip, huh? You're looking. Balrun can give you some tips on you. Ugh. You can thank Belvedere for that one. Well, that's why we were sick of Ulfric. We're not all Dunmer, though. Besides, there's Bal and Bel. <laughs> oh, sorry. I mean, no problem. Glad I could. As a matter of fact, I could actually use. Great. And don't even think about haggling. 
I'm overpaying as it is. Oh. Well, hopefully it doesn't start a shit show. Okay. That was weird. Um, I should probably sleep somewhere. Yeah, for 12 hours. Who are you? I'm Valina Rathvasi. You've probably already met my husband, Belvedere. He so loves greeting all of our visitors. Do you need help with anything? Me? Oh no, I'm fine. You should ask Belvedere though. He's always got something brewing, that husband of mine. Can you tell me something about the village? Of course, dear. I'd be happy to. But you really should ask Belvedere. He'll have so much more to say. Never mind. Ah, what's this? A new visitor to Rathvasi Canton? Welcome, welcome. Oh, God. Rathvasi Canton? As I'm sure you know, little Vivek's namesake consisted of floating structures called cantons connected by bridges. Thusly, it is only natural to call our island's cantons in their honor. It's just so wonderfully poetic, is it not? Who are you? I am Belvedere Rathvasi, leader and founder of Little Vivek and head of Rathvasi Canton. If you need to know anything about our humble home, ask away. Do you need help with anything? A busy man like myself could always use aid. That's why I issue many proclamations to little Vivek citizens to make sure they're contributing. In fact, I have a splendid idea. I can't be bothered to spend all that time delivering proclamations. So why don't you become my official courier and deliver them for me? An official courier deserves official payment. What? The honor is not good enough for you? Very well. I shall offer you 50 septums, but absolutely no more than that. Now off with you, courier. I have much business to attend to. Okay. So, I'm going to Moon and Star. That's who I need to talk to. Let's find out more. Welcome about. back to Rathvasi Ganton, traveler. Can you tell me about the village? Fine, traveler. You could not have asked a more qualified man. Oh, I will endeavor to answer all of your questions with great prejudice. Why is this place called Little Vivek? Ah, now that is a tale, my friend. You see, as we fled the Iron Fist of Ulfric Stormcloak and Windhelm, we headed south to start anew in a new home. We passed many a field and valley, but it was only when I saw this lake that I saw it. A vision of our future, a glorious new beginning. The islands on the lake sitting below a mighty mountain 
It looked just like our ancestor's home in beautiful Vardenfell. And so at once, I called us to a hunt. I decreed it is here we shall build a home, and henceforth, this place shall be Little Vivic, named for our ancestor's great city. And all rejoiced. Golly, you sound like a true visionary. Good? Thank you. It is so nice to find someone who can appreciate that. You'd be surprised what a rarity it is. What services do the village offer? I make sure Celise keeps her trade house fully stocked. But if it's knowledge you seek, I can answer any of your questions, of course. I'll talk to you later. that a mage in Windhold turned a young girl into a frog when he tried to remove a freckles with an enchantment. Scary, isn't it? it what can I do for you? Do you help uh, with anything? I'm not the best guy to ask, but I can tell you what I know. I'd like to ask you something else. All right, go for it. Oh, do you? Perfect, I could use a good laugh. Do you need help with anything? Yeah, actually, if you're looking for work. We're running low on lumber, but I don't have time to run to the Riverwood Mill myself. Mind dropping off an order there for me? No problem. Great. Just drop it off in the order chest by the mill. And next time you drop by, I'll have some septums for you. I don't want to sit in the chair. Can I help you? Do you need help with anything? That would be a question for the less handsome DeRosa. He's the doing things guy. All right. Something you need, traveler? No. But... No. Do you need help with anything? Need? No. Desire, perhaps, if you think yourself a warrior. A group of bandits has been plaguing the woods nearby for weeks, sniffing for weakness. I made sure they found only arrows. Yet still, they linger. I cannot leave the village and hunt them if they are watching. But you could, in my place. Consider it done. Good. You have my thanks. I'll mark their last known location on your map. The leader wears an orcish helm. Bring it to me as proof. I will know if it is his. Welcome back. What I, can I do for you? I have a proclamation for you. Oh, you've got to be kidding. He can't even deliver his little ego droppings himself anymore? By Azura. If only you could sell hot air. 
We'd be the wealthiest village in Skyrim. All right, let's let's just double check. One star. Speak with men to your home. We'll find this guy. He's around here somewhere. It's weird. No place for a book. Oh. not come out of their houses or what? There we go. Welcome back to Rathvasi Ganton, traveler. I delivered your proclamations. Well done, my faithful courier. You have the makings of a fine vassal indeed. Get fucked. All right. Where is this Halu person? Uh, maybe I could do... Oh, they didn't put... They didn't put in a direct arrow above their heads. Okay. That makes sense. I forgot this was kind of... Inspired by... Fucking... Moral wind. Definitely don't see this dude though. Welcome oh back to Rathvasi. This weather is Love mystifying. We better be careful so we don't get lost in this park. Hello. <laughs> Hi there. Who are you? I'm Albert, and this is my best friend, Meat. Say hi, Meat. Hi, Meat. What are you doing? I'm Albert, oh. and this is my best friend, Meat. Say hi, Meat. What are you doing? <laughs> Me and Meat are playing Apocadips. See, the whole world was Apocadips by giant mushroom people. And now me and Meat have to save the world by finding the three dogs! Well, uh, have fun. We will! Sweet Jesus. Where the fuck is this guy? Cree! Whoops. I don't see... What can I do for you? I'm not the best guy to ask, but I can tell you what I know. Besides my brother and myself, there's Balron and Selyse. They basically run the place. And little Albert's running around somewhere. Then there's Belvedere and... Well, like my brother says, the only thing Belvedere is good for is his wife. Yikes. Where the fuck is Mr. Walu? Still getting used to that. Oh, fuck, I gotta go to the river. 
Now I feel stupid. Okay, should I cheat? Should I cheat or should I run there and run back? I have to find this dude here. No, gotta go to fucking Riverwood. I'm stupid. Pay attention, fucking quietest. Yeehaw. Bitch is still running back and forth. How dumb can you be? Wold! How, where you go? Oh, here we go. No, no. Summon ice spike left. Fucking wolves are similar. give him a chance to talk it out, but you took care of it for me. Let's do uh quick save. Riverwood. Has my son Sven asked to join the war? Not this again. If he does, tell him how bad the food is, and how dangerous it is. Look, old woman, if your boy wants to learn how to fight, we'll teach him. Now off with you. Dorothy? I was thinking I'd knit a couple of blankets, sell them to Lucan. Would you like to make one? I want to go home to my fun. mom. Working together? Oh, um, well, you see, 
Dorothy, listen to me. Your father and your friends. I think Luke and was your really mom. happy that you understand? Gold clothes. Please show your medical effect. Come on in. Let me know if you need anything. Or take a seat by the fire and I'll send someone over. Can I help you? I believe you sent for me. So I did, Dragonborn. Hmm. Amazing. You possess so much power, and no one could tell by looking at you. Back to business. As neighbors, Skyrim and Morrowind share more than a border. Our fates are intertwined. We must look out for one another. As such, when a famous criminal from Morrowind was spotted in Skyrim, I was dispatched by House Hlalu to find him. However, he is too deadly for me to face alone. I need a hero's help. If it's a matter of justice, then I'll gladly help. Excellent. You are as noble as they say. Nonetheless, I would feel guilty without rewarding such valor. Five hundred septums awaits you, if you succeed. I tracked the criminal to a village southwest of here called Little Vivek. But after that, the trail went cold. However, you may have better luck. Do you have any other information about this criminal? Not only is he a fearsome combatant, but he is silver-tongued. If he begs for his life, do not believe a word he says. What will you do in the meantime? I will continue my investigation elsewhere. I have another lead I'd like to explore. I'll be sure to contact you if it bears fruit. I better get started. Wait, before you go, take this ring. The criminal is known to wield enchanted blades, and this may protect you from them. Happy hunting, Dragonborn. And many thanks. You are doing both Morrowind and Skyrim a great service. Glowy eyes. Wold. Wold.
Ah, isso é bom. Summon Ice Spike left. Speak to me. I will bear your burdens gladly. What's next? That was weird. Something on your mind? What are we trading? Okay, let us get back to it.
Something you need, traveler? Have any visitors passed through the village lately? Yes, though few of note. Who are the ones of note? A curious question. More curious from a stranger. Well, here's the bandit leader's helm, but all the bandits were dead when I arrived. This is indeed the helm. It carries the dent I gave it, and he was already slain. Curious. Could it have been him? Do you know who did this? Who was it? I may, but no. You tried to do our village a service. You have a right to know. A warrior passed through here, wearing armor from Morrowind. A powerful man, and honorable. We discussed much. I mentioned the bandits to him, but I did not ask his aid. He must have offered it anyway. Those poor fools. They never would have stood a chance. Please, can you tell me where he went? It's very important. He said he was seeking a Dwemer ruin called Kagranar, far to the east, near the Morrowind border. I cannot say more. I am sorry. That is enough, thank you. You are welcome. I do not know why you seek him, but if you find him, I urge you, think before you act. Guess what? I found one of those ingredients I was looking for. Isn't that great? Something you need, traveler? travel do I want to fast travel that is the question it's quite a ways away oh. fast over the river riverwood and then I'll uh, I'll go to Windhelm. I don't know. Someone said Bellator sold his grandmother for 50 gold, and uh, although it sounds... That mm -hmm. is crazy. Who buys a grandmother?
The sky is so beautiful tonight. Don't you think so too? Yes, it is a wonder to be old. That would be pleasant. If our friend is in agreement, maybe we can convince him. That many red guard women in white drum. What do you think? Could it be Alma's wife, Sapphire? Have you ever tried ski the tail soap at the drunken huntsman? It's not that. But it would look better if they took out a tail before serving. That's right up to stay the night, eh? Where do you want to go? Get the fuck up. Climb and back and no. we'll be off. No. Where do you want to go? Uh. Climb and back and we'll be off. You ever met one of them cats? Khajiit, I think they call themselves. I hear there's whole countries full of them down south. Oh shit, I'm stupid. I should have went to Riften. Damn it. Need a ride? Where do you want to go? Riften. Climb and back and we'll be off. Oh, steady old. watching. Ooh, that's cool. Um, Shoot him! 
I'll smash his head. Oh shit. You will make a lot of patience. I'm not sure how to lower the ch oh, okay. Strange. Spike. Let's do this. This is what we were born to do. Isn't a good armor. It's a good, strong weapon. Time to pray. Definitely want to, uh, well, you. Can I do that? No, I'll do that later. Do I have to just sit here and like wait it out? Like how does this work?
Alright boys, this is it. Summon an ice spike left. You make me nervous when you do like that. Keep an eye on the road or you might trip and fall. What is on your mind? Ah, your hands are freezing! Okay, let us get back to Wouldn't it. Wouldn't it be nice to just talk a little, you and I? What do you need? Talk later. What do you need? I'd like to trade with you. Hey, do you want my help? What do you need? So, uh, where are we going now? So, is there anything you'd like me to do? What do you... So, is there anything you'd like me to do? Ah, 
I do not believe Anytime. all dragons are bad. They may be smelly and violent, but you could say the same about a lot of people too. Agreed. But uh, people won't sit on the rooftops and spit fire. That's the difference. <laughs> Indeed. I of course don't want to nag. Sure. As you wish. So, uh, what are we going now? Powerful magic given form, two souls that binds with an ancient force. Let me give you some room. Powerful magic given form. Two souls it binds with ancient force. Huh. Do I have to put... Noise. Must have been a smash. Ah! 